Okay. Right. Now then, where am I getting all my uh, CNC parts from? Printers. This one doesn't work unfortunately, even though it does look brand new. glass there. Mix them up a lot. Yeah. Dark in there. Okay. And then two screws in the back. Let's see what that does. Oh we've got two screws on the top as well. You see, you might help if I put some light on the subject. A bit dark in here. I know the camera doesn't uh, make it look dark. How's that? Is that better? Yeah, that's better. Okay. Now. some description. printer stuff is that uh, it's already aha screws as well. Yeah, there you go. Look. Three lovely LEDs for a future use. Tactile buttons. Mm, they'll come in handy. Right. 
See, there we go. And let's see. Nice ferrite core coming out here. Use that in a jewel thief. Could be good, wouldn't it? Give you so much for nothing. That's another point. I've got um, a jewel thief circuit I'm working on at the moment for uh, low level, sorry, low light level charging from an ICV. And uh, when the solar panels go down to um, a low voltage at low light, you know, the sun's going down or coming up, then um, we get every last bit of. Juice, if you like, out of the uh, solar panels. There we go. Nice light. and uh, gear assembly. Nice little servo motor. Yeah. All right. 
light that uh, came off intact. And there's a nice long ribbon cable. Love the uh, pulling off of here. Oops. I love recycling. <laughs> I wish I could recycle the plastic as well, but unfortunately um, I can't. Now then, taking glass out of these things, be very careful. Although they're probably a tempered glass, they might uh, shatter. So just remember that and keep an eye on that. There's two pieces I've got out of the two scanners now. So I can see some uh, cheap solar panels coming on. Right, that's that. Anybody want to be on TV? Okay, let's get rid of these inks. By the feel of them, they're absolutely empty. <coughs> no, that wasn't the problem. Okay, now then. Fingers are too big. One, thank you. <laughs> okay. Well, then that's the electronics for the printer head. So let's get uh, the carriage out. And then we have screw there. Uh, do it bit by bit, shall we? Might be a good idea. Yeah, as I said, this is going to be the X axis, the backwards and forwards bit. And uh, it should be very good. I'm looking forward to using this. Oops. Um, because it means I'll be able to uh, get and make printed circuit boards to my heart's content. I have in the past used the um, toner method. For um, you know, the photographic paper, and then iron it on, and then etch it that way. But I've um, not had much luck with that lately. Right, we need to get down in there. Uh, I thought I'd make myself um, a CNC machine. Now I'll have, I'll have that, the x-axis if I can figure out how to get it out of here. Comes off there. There. Oops. Like that. Oh, blimey. Ten million clips later. Right, that's the motor. If 
this out, but I know. out from the front. There we go. Weird. Let's try from the sound. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Die. Die. Chat. Die. I'll be back in a bit, people. <laughs>